Hey everyone, this is Carla R. Jenkins and I just passed my Azure Administrator Associate exam this past Wednesday night and this video is about the three lessons learned that I got from passing it. So, number one is the associate level is different from the fundamentals. Yes, I took AZ 900, but the first time I took the AZ uh, 104 I actually failed it I scored 612 to 700 over 700 it's a different beast it's more than just vocabulary and words and associations you have to delve deeper into uh, serving as a systems administrator and that's something I wanted to let you know so yes AZ 900 prepared me for that I also took DP 900, which is Azure Data Fundamentals, and AI 900, which is Azure AI Fundamentals. But I will say that don't solely think because you pass AZ 900, which is Azure Fundamentals, that you instantly are going to pass AZ 104. Um, it's a different level, uh, different um, intricacies and knowledge. Uh, number two is be prepared for the Azure certification changes. So I started studying for AZ-104, I believe it either mid-November or December, and there's been like two changes, two, two to three exam changes since then. Having gotten two certifications from Amazon Web Services, I wasn't really accustomed to Amazon, not Amazon, Azure changing so much. But if you are going to go through a Microsoft certification, get ready for them to update or make changes every two to three months. So that means that if you do decide to pursue a certification, try doing it within um, 30 to uh, 60 days because it changes so much. But that just means it's imperative for you to stay current on all of the functions and the inner workings of Microsoft Azure. And then number three, labbing is everything. That's something I always loved. I always loved getting my hands dirty, uh, doing command line interface, doing PowerShell, doing coding and programming. I've been doing that for nearly uh, uh, over a decade, a very, very long time. And uh, this is very core to your passing as your administrator because you'll be working a lot with the command line interface or PowerShell, SSH, um, which is secured cell uh, interface to get into an to get into a system, into a, a virtual machine, into a cluster, um, to assign rights and privileges to people. So that's something I would also say. So those are the three lessons learned. The associate, number one, is different from the fundamentals. Uh, the Be ready for the Microsoft Azure certification changes because they change every 30 to uh, 60 days. And then number three, labbing is everything, especially as a systems administrator. So those are the three. As always, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe to my YouTube uh, right here, the button and the uh, bell icon to never miss any videos in IT cloud and project management. And for all things Carla R. Jenkins, check me out on CarlaRJenkins.com.